hey guys welcome back to my channel so today I wanted to film a haul but I also wanted to include some of the stuff that I got for Christmas because I didn't I didn't want to just do a whole what I got for Christmas video because it was too much different random stuff so I just wanted to pair the stuff I got for Christmas and a haul and just do all beauty related stuff so let's get started okay so the first thing that I got for Christmas was the Anastasia self-made palette I was so excited to get this. My mother got it for me. So that's the first thing that I got. I'm just going to pull random stuff and I'll tell you if I got it for Christmas and stuff. This, I also got this brush set for Christmas. My sister got it for me. It comes with six brushes and a makeup brush cleaner. So yeah, I'm really excited about this. Another e.l.f. product that I got for Christmas was this little kit that my sister got me the elf devil get the look yeah it comes with um, a brush some eyelashes an eyeliner a lipstick and a primer and then a, a little duo eyeshadow so okay, um, then this I bought from Ulta I was looking for a new foundation well I actually bought three foundations but yeah this is the Too Faced Born this way I've used it one time so far and I really liked it but I just have to make sure to set it because it does leave me oily but I, I like it the second foundation that I bought from Ulta, I was so excited. I was looking all over the place for this. This is the new L'Oreal True Match Lumi Cushion Foundation. And I absolutely love the way it looked. I've used it one time and it looked so nice on my skin. I loved it. My skin looked this so fresh and healthy. So yeah, this. And another foundation that I bought... From Ulta. I went a little foundation crazy. It's the new Maybelline Dream Velvet Soft Matte Hydrating Hydrating Foundation. And I wanted to try this because it said a hydrating matte foundation. But I got it on today. This is my first time using it. And I like the way it looks. I'm going to see how it wears. But yeah. From Ulta was the new Maybelline Loose Powder. It's, it's supposed to kind of be like I think the Laura Mercier you know secret brightening powder so I wanted to try this out because it's a very way cheaper alternative and I never tried the Laura Mercier one because it's expensive it's like 40 40 dollars I think and this one only costs I think $8.99 or something around there so I was excited to try this out and the last oh no not the last I'm sorry and then another thing I got from also was the the Maybelline color tattoo. This is in a stick form. And this is in the color creamy chocolate. And this is what it looks like. I'm going to swatch it for you guys. Ugh, it's beautiful. Then my good friend Tiffany, she wanted to get me some stuff from Ulta. So she bought me some stuff. I'm going to show you what she got me. I needed a setting powder that I can set my foundations with so I'm gonna she told me this one was good so I'm gonna try the true match you know the super blendable powders so I'm excited to try these I bought two um, eyeliners from NYX this wasn't is in the color moss and th this is in the color moss as is, and this is in the color sea foam green so I'm gonna swatch them Ooh, pretty they're cool oh, I didn't know they were so glittery Pretty. Oh, this is <laughs> this is moss and this is sea sea foam green. And then I also picked up a nail polish. This is from the Insta Dry Sally Hansen, and this is in the color Petal Pusher. Such a pretty pink. I just noticed that. I don't have mascara on, but whatever. So I placed the... Oh, wait. Okay, so two things that I got from Macy's was the Anastasia's Illuminator Powders. This is in the color Rivera. It's working. Dun -dun. Huh? This is in the color Rivera. Sorry about that. Yeah, I'm excited to try this out. Let's see. I think I swatched it. This is what it looks like. It's really pretty. Excited to try this out. And then I bought another. That's my son. 
another beauty blender because my son ripped the tip off my other one so I had to buy a new one and I placed the order on Colourpop I got a few things so the first thing that I was excited about was the new casting light squad I have the other one the where the light is and this one is called where the night is really pretty colors this is what they what they look like it's telepathy Winnie Porter and midnight really pretty colors in this and then I picked up a couple of lippy sticks I think well five lippy sticks I have the color Aquarius this is the Kathleen lights one and Taurus which is also the other Kathleen lights one that came out with the quad palette and then I have pitch I have peacock and then I have creature so I'm gonna then I got two the liquid lipsticks and I got mixed reviews about these so I wanted to finally try them some people say they're good some people say they are bad some people say that they have a different formula now so I picked up these two but I'm not gonna swatch trap because I'm actually gonna give this away to my friend but I will this one is stingray this was in the co collaboration with it's my ray ray here on YouTube so I'm gonna swatch that oh so pretty so I hope these are good so I can order more and this is what Stingray looks like. This one. Some people say they're good, some people say they're bad, but I finally was like, you know what, let me just try them out myself. So for Christmas I also got this gift set from Victoria's Secret from my aunts. Yeah, I haven't really opened it yet, but yeah. And then my sister gave me this for Christmas as well. This. Britney Spears Curious it's my one of my favorite perfumes and then Bath and Body Works is having their semi-annual sale so I just picked up a couple things I didn't go crazy overboard so I just got two of these sprays this one is called cotton and lemonade oh, it smells so good and this one is Mag Mag magnolia and Clement clementine Clementine, yeah. These were $3.50 each, so I just bought two. Then I wanted to pick up some of their aromatherapy. Something from their aromatherapy line, but it wasn't on sale. But I still wanted to try this one. This is the stress relief, and it's the body wash and foam bath. And it smells really good. And then I just bought one candle because the Bath and Body Works that's by my house they only had literally one candle in the store which was this one and it was on sale for ten dollars but it smells really good so i just picked it up and it's called the cinnamon caramel swirl okay and that completes my little haul and christmas stuff that i got so thank you for coming to my channel please subscribe comment leave any suggestions below and if any new youtubers want to collab with me please let me know so we could get that going yes yeah, so i hope 2016 is a wonderful year for everybody and let's make this our year and yeah so i'll see you guys in my next video bye